What's poppin' YouTube? Michael here. Today we have the unboxing of the iPhone 12 Pro Max. If you missed my other unboxing of the iPhone 12, I'll leave a link down in the description below, as well as an iCard here. This is pretty much gonna be the same thing, but it's just bigger. So let's open it up, see what we get inside the box, and uh, give our first impressions of it. So I just took the plastic off, and here we have the iPhone 12 Pro Max box. That is a long title for a phone. Before I open this up, I just wanna let you guys know I am coming from a 10s max ended up not getting the 11 didn't think it was worth the upgrade but the only reason i actually got the 10s max was because i like the bigger screen so the 12 pro max is definitely the phone for me quickly kind of comparing boxes here this is the 10s max and this is the 12 pro max you can see the box is just considerably smaller mainly because this package does not include a usb wall adapter to actually charge your phone and this one does this one also doesn't include headphones and this one does so we'll take a comparison of what this looks like when we get this out of the box this is pretty much the same as the 11 pro max we'll just set that off to the side there and while i'm opening this up i just want to remind you guys be sure to subscribe to my channel if you are new hit that thumbs up button it really helps out the youtube algorithm and let me know in a comment down below if you're getting a new iphone 12 and which one you're getting so let's open this up for the first time and take a look at the phone so right away we can see the color that i got i ended up getting the pacific blue here i was really hesitant to get the pacific blue i was debating between the black and the specific blue here but i'm really liking that so far and right away i can tell these are just much larger sensors that is one of the big things with the 12 pro and the 12 pro max as you get larger sensors as compared to the 12. So we'll take a closer look at this in a second let's set that off to the side and see what else we get inside the box here so it looks like we do get a cable here this looks to be lightning to USB-C, so you do get a cable, but you will need a wall adapter to actually charge it. And then taking a look at the literature we get here, we get a SIM eject tool to change carriers or change SIM cards. You get some instruction manuals, and then you get one single Apple sticker. Other than that, not much in the box. Let's close this back up, and let's take a closer look at the actual iPhone 12 Pro max here so let's take off the cover here actually before we do that you can see they do have some outlines and drawings here indicating where the buttons are so you can see we have a power logo here indicating the power button we have a volume down a volume up button indicating the volume buttons and then our mute switch and it looks like right there we have a lightning logo indicating that there is a lightning port on this not USB-C. this is lightning so let's open this up for the first time take the screen off or the screen protector rather always so satisfying with a new device and there is the new iPhone 12 Pro Max in Pacific Blue. Now let's compare this to the 10s Max, which again is about the same body style as the 12 or the 11 Pro Max. You can see here it's pretty much the same. The 12 Pro Max looks to be just a hair bigger. Of course, on the sides here we have a round edge, which is uh, something I was never a huge fan of. I much more like the the squared off edges, just feels better in the hand. And I believe they're about the same th thickness. I think this one's actually a little bit thicker, um, but you can quote me on that in the comments if you'd like. Of course, the big thing here between the at least the 10s Max and the 12 Pro Max, at least physically, is a lot of difference in the cameras there. Also, the internals are gonna be much quicker on this, the A14 Bionic chip is in the 12 Pro Max and it is a very, very quick processor. The other thing that is different here is you'll see there is a 5G antenna there and I'm trying to get a good shot of it. So there you can kind of see it. You can see there's a bunch of smudge marks around here because it's stainless steel, but there is actually the 5G antenna. So of course, all the iPhone 12 models are capable of 5G. And on this side, you can see the only thing you got here is a SIM eject tool and then just your standard buttons. So here's just a closer look at that Pacific blue. I am really liking that Pacific blue. And just a closer look at the phone overall. The other cool thing with the iPhone 12 line of phones is it does have MagSafe in it. So you can see if we take some magnet paper here, you can see MagSafe there. And MagSafe will allow you to connect accessories to as well as a new charging puck that they have. I don't have any MagSafe accessories right now. I have a case in the mail but it is an option on the 12 model of phones. And the last noticeable difference here that actually isn't noticeable unless you, unless you really look for it, this is a 6.5 inch screen, whereas this is a 6.7 inch screen. So there you have it, the unboxing of the iPhone 12 Pro Max. First impressions, this looks amazing. I'm really liking that blue, like I mentioned earlier. I think it's gonna be a welcome upgrade from the 10s Max here. Really like this squared off design. I think a lot of people are gonna like that. And I know from other videos online and other reviews that the processor inside this and just the overall phone in general 
is a pretty big step up from the 11 and definitely a big step up from something like the 10 or the 10s. So again, let me know in the comments down below what iPhone 12 you guys are going to get. If you're not going to get one, let me know why or what phone you currently have or maybe what phone you're waiting for. I know there's a lot of good, really good Android phones out there, like a new Pixel and a bunch of new Galaxy phones. And like I said before, if you're new to my channel, be sure to consider subscribing, hit that thumbs up button. I have new tech videos coming out pretty much every week. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you have a great rest of your day.